Community Service Organization based in Clifton Park holding its annual pumpkin decorating contest. It's called Pumpkin Pals for Pediatrics. Love it. Our Cassie Hudson joins us in studio to carve into this story this morning. Hey, Cassie. Hey, good morning. Now in its third year, Pumpkin Pals is a pumpkin decorating contest for a good cause. The goal of the program is to spread the Halloween spirit to young people who might need it the most this time of the year. These are the sweet faces of the pumpkin pals. These little guys have a pretty big mission. Pumpkins bring such joy that they forget about just for a little while about the things that they're going through. Pumpkin Pals for Pediatrics is a pumpkin decorating contest where everyone wins. Contestants can have fun showing off their creativity, possibly win a prize, and then help perk up children who might need it a little extra this time of the year. Twin Bridges Rotary is behind the Halloween tradition now in its third year. We ask folks to decorate artificial pumpkins, any design that they would like. They could be characters from a movie, they could be anything created. On Saturday, judging will take place at the Prince of Peace Lutheran Church for the pumpkin decorating contest. For those who don't want to compete and just want to help out, pumpkin drop-offs will be taking place during this time. Well, right now we only have about 11 pumpkins, but we usually average about 60 to 70 pumpkins each year. And after the event, all the pumpkins will be delivered to Albany Med or the Ronald McDonald House prior to Halloween. And if it's too late to do it this year, please contact Twin Bridges Rotary Club and consider making a pumpkin for next year because we hope to be doing this for many years in the future. And that service group in Clifton Park is preparing to celebrate its 20th anniversary this December. Now, if you or someone you know want to decorate a pumpkin for the cause, you should know there are separate divisions for children and for adults. Lots of creativity, so if you're up for the challenge, we do have more details at news10.com.